In the dark, no one can hear you scream. Oh my god, is it ever it's a complete mess in here. I have to watch my step. Watch my step. Okay, hold on. Okay, there we go. Uh, what is this? Oh my god, I can't fucking see anything. I mean, I understand, yes, it's supposed to be dark, but holy, the flashlight could be a little bit better. Now, did dude say there was, like, monsters or something in here? You know, at least he gave me a... Okay, it was two-handed hammer. Um... I usually don't have very good experiences with those. Oh, what's this? Uh, fuse. That's what I was looking for. Mm, indeed. I'm kind of glad I went around that way, then. Okay. <laughs> Man, I'm still laughing about the way the armor is in the... <laughs> the fucking wings on it. Like, oh my god. I, who thought up that design? Change the fuse. Quest completed. I see my, uh... Ooh, what's that out there? My crash course in, uh... Engineering finally paid off. Not only am I a psychiatrist, but I like to dabble in electronics. And what's that? Uh, some of the objects can be destroyed with either a free fight weapon or an accurate shot. Oh, really? So what am I supposed to be breaking up? This thing? No, apparently not. Uh, this? Here? Okay, yep. I turned off the power! I'm not sure that would actually work in real life. Crowbar. <sighs> I gotta watch my step in here. Well, yeah, no shit. I can't see anything. Oh, that sounds great. Uh, that probably just closes the door behind me. I probably don't want that. Oh, there we go. So a little bit of light. Thanks, Matthew. Yeah, thanks, buddy. Oh, giant fucking wrench. Ah, more crowbars. Holy crap, what is... What is that? I hear whispering! It's getting louder! Oh, I can't move. Contamination detected. Bottle of AIDS. Alright, so it looks like I'm in the underbelly. Albert Tokai, 34 years old. Albert Tokai, 34, psychiatrist. Albert Tokai, pharmacologist. Albert Tokai, born on the 13th of May, 1999. Albert Tokai. What? Well, at least he knows his name. Well, there'd be people living down here, eh? Hey? What the fuck is going on? Whoa, what the? I think he's gone a little bit insane. Uh, yeah, I don't think I want to go in there. I probably can't anyway. Probably just gotta continue following this long, dreaded hallway with the whisper of voices. I think I'd be like, hey Marcus, you know what? You go fix the fucking fuse yourself. Oh, oh, what the fuck? What the hell? Does it just me or did this... Okay, it just changed into some very creepy temple. Hello. Um... 
Caskets of some kind. Oh, god damn it, it keeps changing my view. I don't want it to do that. God, I hate it when games do that. I know which way I want to look. Automatically adjusts my view, centering it. Gay. And I didn't even actually see an option to change it, to turn it off, so. I think I'm stuck with it. Okay, let's get a fucking move on here. Wandered down this damn corridor far too long. Hide in the tech area. That didn't look like a tech area. I'm sorry. I can say Domino's better than you. Sacrifices are to be made. Whoa. Only then can a nation begin anew. And one of those to be sacrificed has just arrived. Welcome, Mr. Doka. Oh, it's Pigman! Pigman! Bring him to me. Bring him to me. Say what? No! No! Oh, whoa, that's the outside world. I'm pretty sure dude's insane. You're not really listening, are you? Damn, why do I even come here if you're not paying attention? Screw this! Um... I'm sorry, I... Whatever. See you later, Dr. Dozy. Ooh, burn! We'll finish it tomorrow. We'll finish it tomorrow. Okay, so... <laughs> yeah, I know, I know. Um, yeah. Watch you find out it's all just a dream the whole time. Okay, let's see if there's anything on TV now. No, there's still nothing on TV. Right. Satellite must be down still. Uh, Alright, well. Damn, what was it to run again? Uh, well, apparently nothing. It was supposed to be A, but... Okay, fuck it. Let's just go. Uh, I guess it was all a dream. You know, the first uh, 35 minutes of the game, all a dream. I haven't been sleeping well lately. Sometimes I don't sleep at all. And when I finally manage to fall asleep, it happens at the worst possible moment. That in itself wouldn't be such a problem, but my dreams are ridiculous. They're convincing. So convincing that I forget I'm dreaming. When I wake up, images remain vivid, and I'm constantly accompanied by an irritating sense of deja vu. An irrational my sense of deja vu. usually inhabited by restless patients, and now the dead neighbor joined the party. I need to slow down and get some real sleep. So instead of going to the bar, why don't you go to bed? The water tastes like urine. <laughs> the water tastes like urine today. Well, at least I know which way I'm going now. For energy, energy for you. Attention, tram number one, connecting the main atrium with the administrative sector, is arriving at I'm platform number two. Getting a little bit two. of weird choppiness. Have a nice day, Doctor Tokai. Yeah, Al, I've been looking for you. What is it? The Colonel demands your presence in the conference room. Dun dun demand. Dun. Have a nice request. day, Doctor Tokai. You know the drill. And I thought that today couldn't get any better. Don't shoot the messenger. I'm your friend, remember? Uh, I don't know. How He's gonna be the evil one. Of those. Shut up, Jeez, bitch! Wouldn't mind eating something first. Anyways, thanks. So... Uh, first things first, the old prick will have to wait. Not like he has any choice if it's that important. Right, yeah. So we'll just, uh, ignore... 
the boss and uh, continue on going to the bar. Never ask her to walk with me again. It's just pointless. It would have been fucking awesome to see his face. It would have been fucking awesome. You got anything important to say? Probably not, eh? Here, let's uh, let's get some more aid. <laughs> okay, it's down on the ground. I'll just leave it there for the automatic cleanup bots that look really, really strange. Oh, hey, Arik. Sorry, man, but I'm in quite a hurry right now. What's going on? Well, there's a problem I have to fix on the lower level. Apparently, it's a big deal, so excuse me. Take care, Albert. Right. What the fuck are you running around like that for? Oh, my God. Do I run around the same way? Probably. Isn't this where the bar is? Oh, oh no, wait. The, oh, there it is. Bar. Uh, I love the name of it. It's just bar. Whoa, looks like that guy's already had way too much. Yeah, man, check it out. I was like the number one limbo expert in the world. And who are you talking to? You're not talking to anybody. There must be the insanity kicking in. Uh, let's see. Bitch face, where are you? Yeah, she might be downstairs, but let's go over this way. Look, this guy's a limbo champion, too. Oh, there must be uh, some kind of underground limbo Olympics going on soon that I don't know about. I wonder if it's in my PDA. Oh, this guy's doing the robot. Uh, this guy... The, oh my god, I would never sit in these seats, ever. Ever! Ah, oh, and here we are. Meet Colina. Hello. Do you come here often? <laughs> oh, there you are! I thought you'd never come. Sorry, uh, I, I had to finish a session. But it didn't go that well. I fell asleep An again. Patient? This time a sleepy doctor. <laughs> nice job, Doc. Let's not talk about it. It's hard to make an impression as a good psychiatrist if you're constantly falling asleep during Let's not talk you're the one that brought it up. I'm just so tired. Oh, uh, muffin. And now I've been called into the conference room. The colonel's probably gonna send me on a suicide mission. Though I think he would be content just using my head as a dartboard. But seriously, everyone's in one hell of a rush today. Right. Yes, I noticed. Maybe it has something to do with this meeting. Or maybe he maybe. wants to give you shit but for falling really asleep during a, a, a your day at session. He's Don't like, you're not a very good psychologist. It might be something really important. More important than us? You know what I mean, Albert. Well, yeah, the world I'm doesn't sorry. evolve around you two. Green, you didn't need meeting with this old prick. Don't call him that. It can get you into trouble. Okay, you're right. As usual. Uh huh. All right. So I didn't even get food. Oh, what's this? Uh, this is. A note. Ooh. Dear Carolina, we must, uh, we need some ingredients from the food production plant. Would you be so kind and provide us with three kilograms of hydroponic fruit, bananas, or apricots, two kilograms of flour, six eggs, and five kilograms of sugar? I managed to acquire milk on my own. I don't even want to know where you got the milk. Let's see. Ooh, washrooms. Washrooms are always a good source of creepy entertainment. Hey, you want to buy some stem packs? I can't even talk to these people. I, I don't even really have a use key. Ooh, oh god, look at <laughs> that is some dirty toilets, man. You know, the designs on the concrete walls are kind of nice, actually. So far, I've finally found something about this game that looks nice. <laughs> Uh, oh, you know what? I'm going to give it a fair chance. I'm not just going to write it off because it looks exactly like Dead Space. It controls exactly like Dead Space. I'm not saying this is Dead Space at all. 
Why the fuck am I... Oh, here we go. Dr. Tokai, the Colonel ordered me to escort you to the conference room, in case you had different plans. Like they ever matter. Did the pills help Private Grotsky? Maybe they would. But at a party, Kornat stole them from my locker, thinking they're candies, and fell into a coma. <laughs> at least I know they work. Anyway, let's not keep the Colonel waiting. Colonel. Let us not keep the colonel waiting. Okay, so which way are we going, dude? Well, I tell you, the conference room is really far away Aha. from the bar. Here cometh the chosen one. Eee. A minute longer and we'd have to send a rescue party for you. Not everyone's a clockwork soldier, gentlemen. The colonel's on the line, Doc. Uh, I noticed. You know what your problem is, Mr. Tokai. You're not even trying to be respectful. Uh-huh. I have to wait for you every single time. You disrupt the entire administrative process. I'm sorry, Colonel. I bet he is. Stop. That is enough. There is a problem, Mr. Tokai. On the second sub-level. I'm guessing it's not a technical issue. Rather a behavioral problem. People are acting strange. Oh, tell me about it. This whole place people it are acting strange. Just a leak in the ventilation system. Some kind of chemical contamination. The quarantine procedure sealed all of the laboratory doors, trapping scientists inside. Well, why are you and sending a psychiatrist? But I think, but I think that you should probably send a actual doctor. No, but the technician was already sent. That does not relieve you of your duties. Do not waste my time, Mr. Tokai. Well, you're wasting my time. Uh, okay, I guess. Yes, sir. Jesus, man, they, why didn't, they, you know what, Damn. I, I think, really, in the end, they couldn't have this guy as a technician, so they had to make him something, because it'd be like, oh my god, this would be a total rip-off of Dead Space. Math sealed, meds checked, I think I forgot. Hey, Doc, why so nervous? He usually just sits in his office, fighting phobias and imaginary friends of his patients. Alright. Oh, no wonder he's jittery. Yeah. <laughs> Hasn't seen too much real action since day zero. And you're all about action, huh? That's big talk coming from a military bouncer. Shut your stupid Why is he moving thing, around man? so much? You're in for some real action. God damn, like, they're so jittery. You'll see just how well you do outside your office. Enough of this. Don't worry, Do they model if these guys threat, after Michael J. Fox or something? Hey -o. We've been trained to use these babies. Yeah, we'll keep you intact. As long as you're with us, you'll be fine. What the fuck? Yeah, as long as you're with us, you'll be fine. Eee. Yeah, I'm sure. Well, it has been sealed off, dipshits. I've never seen this gate shut. Hey, Doc, make use of this analytical brain of yours and diagnose the problem. Find a key card. The has the closure syndrome. I would prescribe a key card. Why don't you ask it about his childhood? Maybe it will open to you. And if it won't, just find that damn key card. 
Why the hell weren't we issued one? Man, I've never, ever, like, wow. These guys just, he must have, like, done something so bad that they just now just constantly give him shit all the time. Hey, Doc, why don't you, like, talk about its childhood? Uh, because it's a fucking computer panel, you dipshit. Unbelievable, man. I would, I would just smack these guys around. Okay, well, I think it's pretty obvious. So you gotta... Well, let me check this panel over here. I don't even think I did that. Panel? Nope. Uh, guarantee you I won't be able to get to that panel. Oh, wow! I can actually get to that panel. <sighs> yeah, it's a big old stamina bar. It's kind of pointless, really. Should I climb on this thing, or what? What's going on here? Um, no? Okay, so they put that there for no apparent reason. Couldn't touch any of the other panels, but, uh... Oh, it is moving. Alright. Whoa. Hey, guys. How about a gun? Do I have a weapon? No, of course not. Uh huh. Hey guys, there's a grunty, kind of evil sounding dude in here. Maybe, uh, maybe my powers can be talk about his childhood. Uh, let's see, this is nothing. There's a whole lot of nothing up here. Right. <clears throat> whole lot of nothing. Well, let's just go and have a look. See, um, I can't really even make the kick. Can I go into like a first person? Oops, no, that's a kick. Um, nope, guess not. Ah, access key card. Ding ding. Communications down again. I can see on the camera that something's not right in the reception area. Can contact them. We're going to check it out with Adam. You know where to find us in case of any problems. Miller, grab your gun. We're going for a walk. Yankovsky out. Seacrest out. Okay, so I guess that's a data log. Uh, what is this? Oh, great. I just turned off the fucking lights. Can I open this up? No. Well, I got a feeling that these uh, soldiers are, are cannon fodder anyway, so, I mean, they're probably going to die right away. Ooh, you found a key card. Guys, I think something's wrong. We should send the psychiatrist to do everything. Um, is that? Oh, no, wow. There's, a, like, a whole hallway back here. Big old hallway back here. And it'll probably be a whole lot of nothing, but I might as well check it out. It got very eerily quiet. And this probably won't work either. Nope. Alright, okay, I know what's going to happen. I'm going to have to run down this hallway, hack that door panel, and, uh, yeah. And there's going to be something chasing me the whole time. Probably, uh, you know, the dude with the gruffy voice, because these two idiots will be like, Fire! Fire! And nothing will happen. Okay. Maybe not. Okay, doofus, tea bag, on me. Ah, let's see, barrels. I bet you they explode. I don't 
don't see nothing. Do you see nothing? I see nothing. So we both see nothing? Oh, yeah! Take this tranquilizer gun, Doctor. We don't know the exact nature of these behavioral problems. Gee, thanks. That will certainly solve all of them. Oh. Quit yakking and do something about this gate. There should be a hanger behind it. Okay, hold still. I'll. You're not going anywhere, buddy. Okay, Doc, do your magic. Do my magic? <laughs> what? Yeah, how about sedate him? He's one of my patients. Hey, Roman, hey. Do you remember me? Look at me. Look at me. Look into my eyes. Open your mind. Why, you son of a bitch? You want a piece of me? Oh, this is great. How do you like that? Well, huh? You like it? Man, that's enough. Stop it. Oh, that's... What the hell? It's a tranquilizer you dart. Relax. Back. Oh, yeah. See? He you needed to relax. Overkill? I only wonder why I was the only one to keep a cool head, Mr. Professional. Shit. HQ. Come in, HQ. Why aren't they responding? I'm not leaving them here, so you just got yourself a solo recon mission. Go to the reception and contact the HQ. Looks like security channels are down. All right. Are you crazy? I'm not going anywhere. Why don't we just go back and contact in the traditional way? And give the Colonel another reason to complain how useless we are? Do as I say. You, the you guy just came out report. covered in blood. Yeah. Uh, oh, man. Alright, so let's see here. Alright, so I got my tranquilizer. And, yeah, I know how to fucking aim. I did play Dead Space. Okay. Uh, can I search this body? Oh, his arm looks broken. Well, that figures. I can't go back the same way. Oh, God. Alright, well, off to the deadly room of deadliness.